every home in Canterlot was filled with holiday spirit. <laughs> every home except one. It was said of Snowfall that she was almost as studied as Star Swirl the Bearded. Almost, since every pony knows that Star Swirl was an expert at everything from transfiguration, dimensional calibration, teleportation. We get it. Star Swirl's awesome. Right. The point is, Snowfall was also a powerful unicorn. She wanted to be perfect. Anything that got in the way of that was a waste of time. Ah! Well, that bath is ruined. Snow Dash! Snow Dash was Snowfall's loyal assistant. What do you need? Get this mess cleaned up. Those foolish ponies were ringing those blasted bells outside the window, and I lost my concentration. Whoa, ponies actually enjoying heartwarming Eve. Where did they get that crazy idea? Today is nothing to celebrate. Heartwarming Eve is a menace. A dangerous day for all of Equestria. Dangerous? It's awesome! It's the day we remember how unicorns, Pegasi, and Earth ponies came together in friendship to defeat the Windigos! That silly legend is the problem. Telling every pony that singing songs and being nice will solve anything? I've spent years studying magic, and that's not how it works. I think you might be missing the point. Work hard, learn, and use your skills to better Equestria. That's a worthy goal for any pony. But by all means, if you want to go home early, ignore all of the work you have and spend the rest... <laughs> I hate heart swarming Eve. All of Equestria would be better off if we just skipped the day altogether. Happy heart swarming, they say in the street. Happy heart swarming, they think they're so sweet. Words said so often that they lack any meaning. Why should I join in when I could be intervening? Every pony loves this cursed holiday, but would they be better? With it out of the way. Well, okay. Say goodbye to the holiday with my magic alley race it. The greatest gift that I give today, and every pony will have to face it. No more little games. <laughs> Say goodbye to the holiday! Prepare the spell, no hesitation. All memory shall fade away. See a Equestria's new transformation. No more shall anybody say. Happy Hotswimming! Have us 
little chat. A spirit? I didn't cast any spirit summoning spell. What are you doing here? You don't think a spell like that would get by without some powerful forces noticing? You've got our attention, Snowfall Frost. And we've got some pretty strong opinions on this spell of yours. We? They'll be along in a bit. For now, it's just you and me. Let's get a move on. We got a ton to see and barely any time to see it. I'm not going anywhere. I've got a spell to cast, and I don't need a history lesson about hearts warming Eve. We aren't going to the past to learn about the holiday. We're going to learn about you. Just what do you think you're doing, Snowfall? Decorating the classroom for Hearts Warming Eve, Professor Flintheart. You said you want to learn to be a powerful unicorn, did you not? I do. And what is the way that one becomes a powerful unicorn? Mm -mm. Work hard, learn, and use your skills to better Equestria. And how do these help you to learn magic? I want to be strong enough to stop Wendigos and help ponies. That's just a story we tell little ponies. Real magic takes time to learn. It's your choice. Spend your time learning to become a powerful unicorn. Or play with your toys and make nothing of yourself. Then some distress. Words so careless. Standing there you don't know what to do. Feeling helpless, can't make it hurt less, so you go and change your point of view. And in that moment, though you didn't know it, your defenses set up walls you built to last. Leading to the pony you've become today, and the spell you're about to cast, it all comes from your past. The seeds of the past. We grow up so fast, some hearts never go away.